So you know, the question is, is why is space important to yeah. you and everyone else in Armadillo, and how are you making it possible for the rest of us to go? Uh, space is important to me because of a lot of technical reasons. And one of the reasons is that, for example, with the opening of space, we started to launch a communication center. Communication is critical for all aspects of, of the world. And one of the benefits I see is also there's sort of a thrill of actually going someplace that's very difficult, very, very difficult environment. Uh, one of the things that Armadillo is doing is really changing, I hope, the paradigm of how much it really costs to go to space. It's no longer the thing of governance. It's now come, the price is coming down as we move technologically forward. <laughs> The benefit to the individual is that potentially there will be flights to space for what is what is presently the price of a first first class ticket to uh, Europe. For the flight would be fast and it would be a thrill ride, to be sure, but there are a lot of other benefits in that. I see that the opportunity the opportunities in space presently are wider. The government at present has no economic plan, and uh, kind of like the fax machine, people said, who would ever need to send a piece of paper over a fax over a telephone to another machine? Uh, a lot of people are unaware of the potential, and even we, in some ways, are unaware of what the potentials can possibly be. Uh, I, see it, I see it as a benefit for a lot of uh, Presently, there's a lot of attempts to do uh, medical development in, uh, with regard to processing. Uh, there's the tourism market, which is the biggest market right now, potentially commercially for space. And obviously, there's the uh, fast, uh, fast reaction type force for military applications for space, which may fall under the purview of governments, but uh, if they can get it done a lot less, then it far less of a burden on your tax paying dollar. Thank you. This is a pixel, the uh, entry from Armadillo in the Lunar Lander Challenge that I mentioned earlier, sponsored by NASA. Unfortunately, it didn't quite make it last time, but hopefully they fixed the legs since then. It's not going to be one of the first